Like I said yesterday, one of the best parts about being Armenian is the food. Today was full of food and traveling. I think after you guys see this video, you're gonna definitely wanna try some Armenian food. Take a look. To give you an idea of just how hospitable Armenians are, this family only found out about an hour and a half ago that we are coming. They made this lavash handmade in their clay oven just over my shoulder. All of these vegetables are grown in their backyard. The wine is handmade and they even made this sour cream from scratch. Uh, a couple who lives right here under the shadow of Salmo Savank. They're the caretakers of the church, the 13th century church. They take care of the village that has given soldiers in the, in the war. So we, uh, we raise our glass uh, to the Armenian dream, to the miracle that is Armenia. From there, we went to another place to, of course, have more food. Check out this guy making fresh Armenian bread called lavash. Please tell me what city we're in. We're in Abaran, the old Bash Abaran, which, which defended the fatherland in 1918, and now is a home to a booming uh, bakery right at the intersection with the best water in Armenia. We try the water fountain outside. This is the cleanest water in Armenia, so of course I have to try it. Mmm, very refreshing. And I wasn't the only one who wanted to try the water. A few of my aunts wanted to get in on the fun too. Maybe they were just thirsty. As you can see, food is a big part of our culture. And coming up in the next hour, I'm going to show you where my ancestors came from. Reporting from Yedavon, Armenia, Jacqueline Sarkisian, CBS 19.